class today, Geometry students, on this Monday the 14th. I hope you guys had a good weekend. I hope you're ready to cover some math today. We have a lot to do, so please listen carefully as to what we're going to do today. First of all, the exam for this class will be on Wednesday, okay? So study all of the review videos I've given you, all three of those, <coughs> from last week, and make sure you're ready for your exam on Wednesday. There will be no fill in the blanks on your exam, okay? None. Okay, there's nothing to turn in. There was no homework given to you over the weekend. Incomplete. I don't think we have any. <clears throat> no, we do not. Um, remember, guys, if you're absent one day or many days, it doesn't matter. The first day you come back, if we're taking a test or a quiz, you will take it. Unless you pre-contacted me about why you could not watch the videos while you were absent, okay? Please don't forget that. Today we're going to be going over your chapter 6 test and then doing a little algebra review. The name of the test correction video is Geometry Track 1, Chapter 6 Test Corrections. Now at this time, listen, I want your tests out. Miss Carol, you can roam the room and walk around the room and make, make sure the students are correcting their problems. Students, you're not going to turn these in. Please do not turn these in, okay? <clears throat> but um, I told you to hold on to these. We're going over them today. I want everyone learning um, what your mistakes were, finding your mistakes on these problems. Now, when that video is over, here's the next video you're going to watch. Algebra 2, Lesson 2.3. It's about 23 minutes, okay? Let me explain what we're doing in my classes. We do not believe in wasting time, okay? We don't have free days and goof off days. We do math, okay? And one thing that a lot of students struggle with is graphing linear equations by using the double intercept method, the slope intercept method, and the table of values method. So every chance I get, I did this last year also, so it's not just you guys. It's not busy work. It's putting stuff in front of you to make you think and constantly helping you stay on top of your math. So having said that, we're going to watch this kind of a review video. I know it says Algebra 2, but it's a review from Algebra 1. And I want you to watch it and take great notes on it. Miss Carol, please listen to this carefully. I don't think you're going to get both of these finished. So this one's first. This one's second. Wherever you stop at, Miss Carol, email me so I know how much of this you have left to finish tomorrow, okay? That'll help me plan tomorrow a lot better, okay? All right, moving on. Um, uh, that should be it. That's all for today, students. Please get started.